what's going on everybody how we doing have you ever wondered what is inside of these automatic emptying self-cleaning robot vacuum base stations i've been kind of wondering that myself so we are going to take this guy apart and see exactly how these function should be pretty cool looking should be a bunch of tubes suction motors we're going to find out soon in this video so i have this lightstro w2 Great mopping robot combo, if you're interested. I did a review on it uh, months back, and it's been good overall. Um, but yeah, I just want to see what's inside. Shouldn't be that hard to take off. Looks like there's just a bunch of screws in the back. So this video, we're just going to pop this open, see how it's made, how it works, and uh, something that I've ne actually never seen on any video. So let's go ahead and get into it all right let's go ahead and take this apart it shouldn't be very hard i believe it's just all these screws around here and then this should just pop right off hopefully you never know so i got my drill i'll probably have to take these out as well let's try it without first okay i definitely have to take those off as well which is fine quick here we go we ready there's the back panel a couple more screws here to hold on the uh, cord wrap and holy cow that is a lot more a lot more stuff than I expected wow so here's the self empty bin part this is what's gonna suck the debris from the robot up into the dirt bag lots and lots and lots of wires a ton of more wires than I thought uh, but I know this is the clean water tank. It's going to pump water through these tubes, come over to this. I think this is supposed to have hot water that cleans the mopping pad. So I think this is actually a pump that heats up the water. Um, then it's going to come through here, through this tube. That goes down here, separates onto two tubes. And then this is what pumps the what should be hot water onto the reservoir and onto the mopping pads themselves helping to clean then once this reservoir on the other side of this is clean this bigger tube it's going to create a suction motor it's going to take all the dirty water and pump it up through this hose and put it into your dirty water tank here of course is the plug for the main power and yeah this is much more wires and complication than i thought it was going to be I thought it was going to be pretty simple behind here. What do you guys think? Just wanted to make a quick video, kind of showing you the inside of this. This is something I've never seen personally. I think it is pretty cool. A lot of technology in here. A lot of stuff that needs to work perfectly in order to make this work as it does. So pretty cool. Um, I'm glad I did it. Just something nice and quick. Let me know what you think down in the comments. If there's something you want me to do further, let me know and maybe I'll try to make that happen for you. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. If you know more than I do, which I'm sure a lot of you do, go ahead and feel free in the comments and tell me what I said wrong or if you specifically know what each part is. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that quick little video. If you did, smash that like button for me. Consider subscribing. I'd really appreciate it. And have yourselves a great day. See ya.